The Blue Sky Bio Fully Guided Keyless Kit is a simple, ideal solution for guided surgery that offers maximal ease of access by eliminating surgical keys. The drills range from 2 mm in diameter to 4.6 mm in diameter and the lengths range from 6 mm to 16 mm. Virtually position the implant in the best restorative and surgical position. In the drop-down menu at the top of the implant list, choose the fully guided keyless kit. This will automatically set all the surgical guide tubes to the ideal position. The printed hole in the surgical guide represented by the brown software guide tube is housing the metal cylinder in the surgical guide. The hole has the correct inner diameter and is automatically positioned to guide the drill to the correct position and to stop the drill at the correct depth. The drill length creates the osteotomy at the perfect depth for the relevant implant. Print the surgical guide and insert the metal cylinder. The fit of the guide should be verified before the surgical procedure. The drill flat profiler should always be the first drill used in any surgery. Then always start at the upper left hand side of the kit with the 2.0 by 6 mm drill. Sequentially use the 6 mm length drills until the final desired diameter is reached. Once you've reached the final width, now proceed to increase the length of the osteotomy to its final size. When choosing the Biomax 5 mm by 10 mm implant use these specific drills. The drill bit consists of three parts, the stopping section, the guiding section, and the cutting section. Insert the guide into the mouth. Insert the drill flat. Activate the drill flat in the master tube only after it's inserted in the guide and is centered by the master tube. Drill with copious irrigation and drill until the drill is stopped by the master tube. It is recommended to drill at 800 to 1200 RPM with copious irrigation. Insert the 2 by 6 mm pilot drill without spinning until it advances to the depth created by the previous drill. Activate the drill and advance until stopped by the master tube. Repeat this process with each drill in the sequence until you've reached the appropriate osteotomy depth and diameter. Place the 8.5 mm fully guided carrier into the implant. Insert the implant and driver through the guide using the ratchet until the stop on the guided carrier bottoms out. It is very important to stop ratcheting the implant the moment the stop touches the guide tube in order to avoid stripping the bone and losing primary stability. The cover screw is inserted into the implant and the flap is sutured. Adequate time is allowed for the implant to integrate. 